What's up guys and welcome back to the life of Kevin, or should I say the death of Kevin, <laughs> I'm sorry. Spoiler warning, if you missed last episode, I may have faked Kevin's death and made people think the series was over, but it's not. As you can see, Kevin is fine. Our house, on the other hand, is not. <laughs> But yes, I was really happy with that episode. When I heard that song from the fat rat, uh, Never Be Alone, I dreamt up that entire montage. I, I knew months ahead of time that I wanted to fake Kevin's death to that song. And it came out exactly like I wanted it to. I was so happy with it. People were leaving the best comments. Just everything about that video I was so happy with. All the comments. People took it really well, actually. The community took it well. I was happy that you guys weren't super mad you know i made some people happy i made some people sad it was a roller coaster of emotions <laughs> even though everybody is fine our house is not i mean that was staged but the fire is still a fire <laughs> emma was pregnant she can't put out a fire tommy's a kid he can't put out a fire and kevin was already ignited i didn't want to send him in again because i'm pretty sure if you get ignited for the second time you'll actually die so our house is kind of just a pile of charcoal we're homeless <laughs> So I think this episode we're going to have to live in the park, which um, should be interesting, especially because Emma is super pregnant and probably going to give birth this episode. Kevin being a MVP now, he just went off to work. What is? What are you now, Kevin? MVP. He is the highest level of... Um, second highest level, I think? One of the highest levels of athlete. So he's got money in the bank. Hopefully, because we don't have any money right now, at the end of the episode, the house will be fixed and we'll be able to move back in. But for now, we're just going to kind of have to rough it. Emma, why are you sad? You're the one who killed all of these people. <laughs> Katrina, Nina, Summer. Okay, not Summer, but I mean the other two, they were your fault. It's a good thing that they have um, like some amenities in the park. We should be able to... Oh, no, no, no. Emma, you need to be- you're not Emma, you're Kevin. Emma, you need to be listening to pop music. Listen to pop music. Oh, we need to find strawberries too. I completely forgot about all of this. You guys have mentioned in the comments that if Emma eats a lot of strawberries and listens to pop music, we can have a girl, which is what we're trying for here. Uh, I actually have no idea if there's any strawberries around. I completely forgot about all of this until just now. Are there any strawberries up here? Tommy, we need to go on a strawberry hunt. Quicksilver over here making a lot of meat. Why, why are you preparing all this meat, Quicksilver? It's just unnecessary. I'm not seeing any strawberries, though. I think we're just going to have to uh, rough it with the pop music and hope for the best. Ooh, kids! Tommy, you don't know like any kids. Play Space Explorer. They better not make fun of you for being homeless, Tommy. It's nothing to be ashamed of. When your father burns down the house in an elaborate ruse to fake his own death, that is... That's probably a Simpsons episode, to be honest. Wow, you guys are like the boringest kids ever. Do you do anything? Seriously, they're just... Is this how you play? Oh, there we go. What's wrong with you? I mean, I'd probably be a little hesitant to play too if I had a steering wheel made out of dildos, but at the same time, you still should be doing something, kid. What are you doing, Tommy? Are you gonna make a friend? <gasps> Tech Dag! Hey, look at that. Tommy's making a friend. This, uh, oh, well, is that a girl or a guy? I honestly can't tell. I think it's a guy. Let's check. That is... Nilesh Montanez. Nilesh. I still don't know if that's a guy or not. Oh, I see pink shoes. Again, I don't know if it's a guy or not. You know what, at least Tommy's having a good time. Emma, what are you up to? Emma is sitting indoors comfortably. Okay, that's that's good for a very, very pregnant woman to not be out on her own. Being homeless in this game isn't too bad. I mean, there's uh, there's lots of amenities lying around, like I said. We could probably even go visit people, actually. I never thought about that. We have a lot of friends. I don't think there's anything stopping for us from, like, living in one of their houses. Who on earth is this? This guy looks like he's going through a serious midlife crisis. Look at that rockin' mohawk. And the mustache to boot, and the, the grandfather clothes. <laughs> Emma, you're making weird friends, girl. Oh yeah, you smell that hamburger, you weirdo. <laughs> so, I guess Kim Jong-un is homeless as well, because he just decided to show up and, you know what, I'll take the other couch. Really, man? Oh, Emma, I'm so sorry. We're, we're gonna get through this. <laughs> Wholesome family values. Everybody gets a spot on the benches. <laughs> oh, man. Emma, this baby can't come soon enough. We really need to get our shit sorted out. 
I love this barrel that I downloaded. It's awesome. Oh my god, it's Nina's ghost. Awkward. Just ignore her, Kevin. We're going to talk about the barrel. Kevin can now take family leave. Why can, why can Kevin take family leave? Oh, because Emma is quickly going into labor. Oh my god, it's another ghost. It's Summer's ghost, and because she died pissed off, she's red. We need to get out of this park as soon as possible. Like I was trying to say, this is one of the custom content things that I downloaded. It's just a barrel, but you can tell your sim to warm themselves by it. Uh, when I realized we were going to be homeless, I wanted to find some things that were suitable for a, a homeless attire kind of thing. And this looks really cool. I'll leave a link to the description. And I want to start bringing in more custom content to the series because, I don't know, people like this kind of stuff. I like this kind of stuff. It's interesting to see what people can make in The Sims. That's really weird. Ghosts are being polite and cleaning up and stuff. Look at that. She's actually going to do dishes. <laughs> wow. Can we, and we can like completely interact with them and stuff. I never knew that. Where is everybody? What's wrong? What, what's the problem? Oh, you need to go pee. Go to the bathroom. There's a bathroom over there. <laughs> it seems like every night we're not the only people down on our luck. This is Kurt. Ranches, I believe? He looks exactly like Kim Jong-un with the same clothes. Oh my god. Summer just hopped into an angry toilet. Summer, you can't go breaking that stuff. That belongs to the city. Who's gonna fix this? Oh no, what is she doing? Get away from Tommy. Oh, she's gonna sit down and read a book. That's weird. She's still wearing Emma's clothes, too. That is super weird. Oh, this is not going well. Kevin needs to sleep. Let's see. Emma needs to sleep, and she desperately needs a shower. Tommy needs to sleep. Okay, you know what, guys? We are going to go to somebody's house. We're just going to have to break in or hang out with a friend. See where we can go. Just about everybody was asleep or at work, so we couldn't really go anywhere. So we went to our neighbor's house, our next-door neighbor's. And this is the house of Geralt and Yennefer, uh... Jack and Elsa and Miley Cyrus. So let's knock on the door. No, you guys don't don't go sleep on the park bench. Oh God, we can steal one of their beds. Come on. Okay, we are in now. Let's sort ourselves out. Emma, take a shower. Kevin, go to sleep. There's got to be a bed around here somewhere. Yep, we're taking this one. Tommy, you also need to sleep. Is there another bed? Boom, got it. This is a strange little house. It has like this little like zen garden in the middle of it. It's interesting. I would have never thought to do that. Bills have just been delivered to your mailbox. You owe 12, 13,000 dollars and have 48 hours to pay before we shut your utilities off. One by one, you can pay using your phone, computer, or the mailbox. What the fuck? Why do we owe 13,000 dollars? Tom's gone to school. Emma, you're pissing yourself. Okay, go to the bathroom. Oh my god, I can't handle all of this at once. I think Emma just took Miley Cyrus's breakfast. That's okay. Well, Kevin, we're gonna have to hope that that MVP bonus is gigantic because we're gonna need like 20, no, 30, 40,000 dollars to fix the house and pay the massive bills that we have. Aw, oh, they're so cute. Look at them. Jack and Elsa Frost. Some people were asking about that, actually, when I did the Big Parties mod video. If that actually was who they were. That is Jack Frost from Rise of the Guardians, which was a great movie. I really like that one. And Elsa Frost from Frozen? I've never seen Frozen. I think the, the Disney musicals aren't really my style, but that is who they are. And they're both on the gallery, if you guys want to download them. They're not hard to find. Well, Emma, you may be pregnant, but you're going to have to pull your weight around here, so let's let's do some dishes and stuff. Oh my god. One of my sims is using a kitchen sink. I haven't seen this since, like, episode 3. How majestic. Where's Kevin? What the hell was that? Did you guys just try to hug each other? Seneca. Guys hug weird. <laughs> so is this what pregnant sims normally do? Like when you guys have a pregnant sim, do they just stuff their face with fruit and stand in front of a radio? <laughs> this, this game's weird. Whoa, Kevin, what you doing? Of course. 
Well, let's just hope that the pop music is enough to get us our girl. I already have a name in mind, but I'm not going to ruin it. She should be having the child really soon, I think, because we're third trimester giving birth in question mark, question mark, question mark. They conceived the baby on a Thursday and it's Monday. Sounds about right. Emma, what are you doing? <laughs> really? You're in your third trimester? Oh my god! Did you see those moves? Do that again. That was wicked. Wow, even Kevin doesn't hit like that. She has got some ridiculous moves. Okay, we're not gonna stop her because I'm afraid to stop her. Oh, they are super upset that Kevin is sleeping in their bed. <laughs> They just walked over and had, like, a bunch of negative interaction things. And I guess Geralt is just gonna stand here and watch him sleep. Well, I'm sorry, man. You invited us over and all the other beds were taken. Yeah, you just pump out those push-ups. Oh, no, Emma. That is not what you want to see from your pregnant wife. <laughs> At least she managed to catch the baby from hitting on the ground. Okay, it's time to wake up. We're gonna go inside. We're gonna give you the single bed tonight. <laughs> Um, do you guys, you guys have a problem with this? You can't seriously be upset at the pregnant woman who just passed out in your backyard, sleeping in a single bed. <laughs> Molly Cyrus is just like, oh, there's a little boy in my bed. Oh, he's super upset. Oh, Kevin's gone to sleep as well. Why? They just kind of hang out and watch everybody sleep. Kevin picks the pinkest bed to sleep in, and all the girls are just like, Are you kidding me right now? God, Emma, just have this... Oh! Oh! Emma's in labor, trying for baby. It's go time. Ooh, okay, we learned from last time. I think you can click on a door. Where's where's the front door? Where's the front door? Oh, no. Why is this not working? I was told you can click on the front door, and then you can... You can travel to the hospital. Well, it doesn't seem to want to work this time. I guess we're having it here. And by I guess we're having it here, I mean let's just go back to sleep because apparently it doesn't matter at all. Oh, she's getting back up. What's wrong? Bathroom, go. Oh, oh, I think she's going. Have baby at hospital. Okay. Emma, or Kevin, wake up. Emma is having a baby. Kevin, wake up, damn it. Okay, I think he's going to go. Have baby at hospital. Yes, he's going. You can't go. You stay here. Friends, babysit for us. We need to go have another one. It's a girl! We did it! Woo! Alright. Birth, life, the universe, and everything await. It'll be a long road, kid. Emma has just gave birth to a baby girl. This baby needs a name. What should we call her? Okay, well, we're not gonna name it Yager. We still need to fix that. I always forget. Her last name is still Yager. It should be Sauce. So, uh, last name is going to be Sauce, and her first name is going to be Apple. Tom's full name is actually Tomato, even though we only have down Tom, so Apple's an actual girl's name. Some people think it's a little silly, but I think it's going to work for us, so we have Apple Sauce. Emma has checked out of the hospital and is doing well. The baby is at home resting. What would you like to do? So the baby is just sitting inside our charred home. Okay, we, we need to get this money now. Kevin got his money, we managed to pay off the bills, we have a little tiny bit left in the bank, we fixed everything, even the paintings are okay actually. The fire didn't get into this room because there's a big double door there, it's just kind of spread in through here, and then into the kitchen, and then all through here, but everything seems to be okay, I think we managed to salvage just about all that we needed. And don't forget, Faith is okay, I put her in our inventory, she didn't burn, she didn't starve, she's safely tucked away and will be brought back out next episode. But right now, I can't handle a cow plant and two kids, just give me a minute. Aw, oh, so cute. Right adorable, little apple. That's gonna be it for this video, guys. Being homeless sucked, but it's good to have neighbors that care. You know what? Friends next door that took us in when we needed it, and Emma safely had her baby, and we have our girl. So the, the family feels whole now. It feels like everybody is here. Thank you guys very much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. No, 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 no. No, leave me alone. I think I can hit Alt and look behind me. Uh, oh, jeez. Okay, this game has some crazy boob physics going on right now. We will revisit that when I am not about to get eaten.